Hi, welcome to the Main Street Macro. I'm Neela Richardson. The name Main Street Macro may seem pretty self-explanatory for a blog, but what you don't know is that I actually grew up in a house on a street called Main Street, so I have a personal connection. What you also may not realize is that our homes have a personal connection to the economic recovery. You see, over the last 50 years, the housing market has been a lead actor in pushing the economy into and out of recessions. That is except for a major exception, which is the great financial recession, where housing was more like a ball and chain around the economic rebound, holding it back. So housing, the housing market's role this time around is by no means guaranteed. But there are a couple of things we're watching to see if housing, once again, can be a lead player in propelling the economic rebound. The first is interest rates. Low interest rates increase home buyer demand. It also makes it more profitable for home builders to build new homes. All that buying and building increases demand for other things that the economy produces, like refrigerators and sofas, and that's good for economic growth. The second thing we're watching is supply. After the Great Financial Recession, there was a glut of homes on the market because of foreclosures and overbuilding. This time around, there's actually shortages in, in many neighborhoods on Main Street, and that actually supports continued increases in home prices. The third thing we're watching is home equity. Low mortgage rates near rock bottom levels and also steadily climbing home prices means that homeowners are enjoying a record level of housing equity. And people who have housing equity are more likely to spend instead of save out of every dollar. And anyone who's read the Main Street Macro blog knows consumer spending is a huge part of the economy. So while a booming housing market can't solve all of the economy's problems, the good news for Main Street is just because an economic recovery starts at home doesn't mean it has to end there. For more of our insights on housing and how it will likely affect the economic rebound, please go to adpri.org. Thanks for watching and be well.